Well, hello there. I'm Christine and welcome to my channel. It's been a while and I've been requested by some people um, who have asked me to do some pick a card readings and uh, so here we are. The, uh, I've, just lit and, I've just lit and it's gone out is some beautiful mugwort which is a wonderful herb for um, psychic ability and intuition. And I'll just quickly uh, pass the, the deck through that. Uh, and the crystals, the smoke. I'll have that going while we're working. And the theme of this reading is that of um, different people I've met um, in the last week or so. Uh, I've said, oh, I've met someone online uh, and we're going out and we're meeting up this week and uh, I'd love to know a little bit about them. What, what's this person value? What's important to this person at the moment? So I said, well, that's great. Let's ask the cards. So I'm just going to shuffle the deck. This is a Rider Waite Smith deck, Pam's Vintage Tarot. And the way I do this, I've been working on another platform doing this, is that I just cut the deck in three. Um, uh, and also, um, there I will be taking the top three cards of the reading for your reading, whichever one you choose. So if you could now just go to that place by taking a deep breath in through the nose and then out through the mouth and as you breathe out just make the decision to relax and as you do this I'd like you to go to that place that place in your mind of creativity that place that knows more about you than you know about you and that place where your own intuition and inner wisdom is. And I'd like you then to just focus for a moment in that space and see which cards pile that you're drawn to. Is it the clear quartz, the yellow calcite, or the pink rose quartz? And as you do this, just trust your own inner guidance for this moment. That's right. Now, for those of you who chose the pink quartz, this person that you're meeting up with, what's important to them at the moment, what they are, one of their values is this new beginning, that this new beginning will be grounded and will be also um, an idea of sharing and promising of new things. They could be, you may find that for some reason they're a little bit guarded and reserved, but they are happy to sort of put the work in. And also you have um, this idea that it is a new start and it also is, uh, they're extending the hand of friendship with it. And so th what's important to them is that, that the time and the work puts in is put in to make this lovely f new start with this. And so that's what's important to them. The surprise card on the bottom is that they are looking for someone who is um, going to be there, steady, put the work in and create something that's really worthwhile together. So this person is um, very genuine and grounded and happy to put the work in to make this relationship work. I'll just move those over there so we can do the next one. If you pick the yellow calcite, This 
person, what they value at the moment is that they can move, look, they're looking for someone who can move beyond the problems and stuff of the past and have a positive outlook and see that, um, be able to look forward to the future. And they're also, what's important to them, that they can take it slowly with the Four of Swords and be able to, if they need that time out with it and let it go slowly, that that will be um, that they'll be allowed to do that without any judgment. They are very happy to put the work into the relationship and make the effort and uh, build something that's very worthwhile for that with these cards here. And the card on the bottom is the Queen of Swords, and what the important they value is is that they do not, as I said, they don't want to hear the crap <laughs> from the past. So I recommend <laughs> to not go into all your things that have bugged you, what was wrong with the last person you went out with or your last relationship with this because they will just cut you off. They are wanting a fresh start and in, with this, someone very positive, Someone that's really cool and relaxed as well. They're also, meditation is important to them. And also they're happy to put the work in to build something worthwhile. So that's the cards if you picked the yellow calcite. And now with the clear quartz, we have top three cards with the clear quartz. This person is quite ramped up <laughs> and keen to start something new. They've possibly been out with other people and they're a bit tired of it all and they haven't found what they've been looking for and it's important now that they find what they have been looking for with the cup. And they're very generous and giving uh, and they are looking for, they know what they're looking for in this with the four of cups but they are happy to step up give it a go and start something new with that ace of wands uh however uh it's about talking about i would just recommend you even talk about well, what's important to you what are your values in the conversation and that way um you'll know by their body language whether you are uh, you both share the same values the card at the bottom is a surprise card is the Eight of Cups. And they will be straight up front with you. If you don't share the values, the share the same values um, of getting into it and stepping up and making something work, they will walk. And as I said, you'll know by the first meeting with these cards, if you share the values, Things will work out and get taken to the next level. But if you don't share the value, say if you don't both share the same values, be happy to go your own ways and call it quits because uh, it will not be worth wasting your time with that. So I hope those readings have made sense for you at the moment. Uh, thank you for watching, and I look forward to seeing you again. Bye for now.